For 112 years, Catholic Extension Society has been striving to strengthen the presence of the Catholic Church in the poorest areas of the United States. This past year, one of their main focuses has been Puerto Rico. As you can imagine, the nature of our work has shifted this year uh, in the aftermath of Hurricanes Irma and Maria, which uh, brought so much devastation to the island. Um, you know, over the past uh, seven months or so since the hurricane hit, uh, really the island has been very much in emergency mode. In addition to the physical work of constructing and repairing churches, they're also serving the people in a much deeper way. It's so profound that even Pope Francis noticed them. Rivolgo un saluto particolare ai membri della Catholic Extension Society degli Stati Uniti. Grato per l'impegno profuso nell'opera di ricostruzione in Puerto Rico. Nella gioia del Cristo risorto, invoco su di voi e sulle vostre famiglie l'amore misericordioso di Dio nostro Padre. Il Signore vi benedica. It was such an incredible experience to hear Pope Francis mention our organization, Catholic Extension by name, and thank us for our efforts in Puerto Rico. Um, to say that that was a, a special moment for us uh, would be the understatement of the year. This call-out was the motivation they needed to continue to provide support to the six Catholic dioceses on the island, helping them remain open to especially serve the poor. At least 1,200 churches have been impacted after the storms, and the blackout has only prolonged the emergency mode they've been in for months. They're expecting at least several years before any sense of normalcy returns. But what the bishops have been telling us, what the Pope has been telling us, is that mission, that the church is in a permanent state of mission, that the mission never ends. And that's our identity as well at Catholic Extension. Their mission extends to all areas of the church, externally and internally, through vocations and ministry. As a registered nonprofit, they ask for continued support, just like Pope Francis gave them in Rome, to continue their mission.